Hello and welcome to Odoo. Today I'll be teaching you how to make inventory adjustments. This tool is really useful because often companies need to make physical counts of their stocks in their warehouse and with Odoo we can make that test look pretty simple. So first things first, let's take a look of our products. We can see that we have on hand uh, 20 units of each product which you know we, we did it to make it simple so we can look now that each product has its own uh, internal reference and this is very important because uh, the people in warehouse they really don't care about the name but yes about the uh, internal reference because that's what they will be looking for so we can come here in operations and we'll start our inventory adjustment so we create a new one we can call it um, uh, verification of 2019 stock it's, it's big but whatever so we can now select the products here and we can choose one by one or you can come here and search more there's like filters we can search only by some specific uh, products you can add your custom filter but for now I want all my main products so they're all here so I select this box and I select they're all here now and I'm ready to start my inventory so we can see my on hand quantity there's they're still not counted so let's come back and let's create now the Excel that we will uh, send to our uh, warehouse people so we come here we select the one that we created and we export this is where now we're going to create our excel file so first you want to check this box because you want to update your, uh, your data that means when you import back uh, the file it will automatically update your inventory so you can create a template I already have one that means you're gonna need your inventory ID your counted quantity your location uh, and your product so you can, then you can choose you just need to easily select them here so now we export and we have now our Excel page that our warehouse will get it they can have that they have the names everything's set up they have where is it the internal reference and they have the quantities so we can minimize this now we can import the file that we just exported back here so we see it here and we can see we can test it to see that everything seems valid we have now the quantities we can go back and now let's see uh, people in the warehouse they get this file they start counting and they see that actually there's like 12 of this one there's like only nine of this one there's like again 12 and there's five and then the 10 it doesn't matter just to prove the point that it's really simple after they just confirm all the quantities okay so let's imagine it's all this we save back the file we can close it we come back to our Odoo software and we'll import the file that uh, our warehouse sent us back so we come back to load file and here it is they send it back they have the new quantities here we are ready to go so we test it everything seems valid we can come back we can choose our um, uh, inventory uh, adjustment that we created soon so you can check here that it's still in progress so it's only this one you can tune to our inventory and you can see the counted quantity now it's changed you can check the difference between uh, all of them you validate your inventory your the inventory has been validated so you're good to go you can come back here and check that it's validated and you check in your product that all quantity on hand uh, are modified due to the excel that uh, our warehouse had. i hope you understood everything i hope you have a great day thank you